some people don't think we're we ask hard enough questions. I, I assure you, people in the industry are kind of shocked at some of the questions that you know he's that are being put to him. And he's a great sport about it. Like he he seems to want to really engage, and he he likes explaining things. I think he could do a better job of you know providing. Uh, deeper answers like he's a he's a politician yeah, the politician in him he's definitely a squared answer you know yeah, getting yeah. right around those, sure. those hard-hitting questions but yeah but you know, you know it's really unique i think this is a unique situation to be in that um and I, I i keep using that word but it, it is somewhat unprecedented that um that he's willing to do this no no sec chair has done something like this before you know and that totally. he, it's and it's not just like a one-on-one -on -one thing. It's it's bringing in people to ask their questions, to have conversations, to provide information to him about what they care about. You know, I, I think it's great. We had a half-hour conversation on FTDs and DRS, um, and because that's what people care about. They wanna they wanna know that that the SEC is is aware of these issues. They wanna know. They want the SEC to know that individual investors are opting out of the system and why. Um, and they would like the SEC to address those issues. And, and I really think that it's going to make a difference. <laughs>